I'm Mick Gillespie with the Tennessee Smokies. Arismendi Alcatara was a starting shortstop in last week's Southern League All-Star game. He started in the Futures game, but at second base. Now with the arrival of Javier Baez, Alcantara finds himself every day at second base. Yeah, we haven't shut the door on, on the shortstop with, with Alki. Uh, you know, we're going to continue to work with him at short. He's still going to get some games at short. Um, but with Javi here, he's going to slide over to second base for now uh, in the majority of the time. And it's going to be a real fun, uh, fun tandem to watch in the middle of the field. Baez shined in the Florida State League with the Daytona Cubs. He batted 274. Hit 17 home runs with 57 RBI in 76 games. He also belted four home runs in one game, and at 20 years old was promoted to Tennessee. Hobby's a special player with special tools. Um, he just had a really good start of the year in Daytona. Uh, we felt like this was the right time to send him to Tennessee and uh, hit him in third in the middle of the order here and let him experience Double A for the you know from now until the end of the season. But Hobby's made an enormous strides since last year. And uh, we're excited about how he's progressing and looking forward to watching this club play. Teaming up with Alcantara could also help his development. I just see a middle infield. He played really good and I played really good in the shortstop. And one of us two has to move. So he's playing second base and he's playing short also. I play my game and if I got, I got a question, I know he plays shortstop for a long time. And, and I just ask him and he helped me and I help him. Eris Mendy Alcantara has been a force at the plate. He leads the league in doubles and total bases, is among the league leaders in batting, home runs, stolen bases, and hits. He also has a flair for the dramatic. On his way to third. He's going to try to win it here. The relay throw. Not in time. Smokies win. Alcantara doubles in Caesar. A walk-off victory at the yard. 3-2. What do you say? Unbelievable makeup. Unbelievable kid and works, works extremely hard. Uh, he's obviously got a lot of tools, switch hit get with some power, uh, can really, really run, uh, strong arm, has, is versatile, can steal bases. So at 20 years old, playing in this league and doing what he's doing, hitting second to, you know, in the All-Star game here coming up, uh, we're excited about the progress he's making. And we can play together in the middle infield and can we work together. He's have, he has a power, speed, he's a good player. I look here aggressive in the, in the, in the bat, how he played the game, he enjoyed the game. It will increase his value if he can add another position and, and I for sure like the way his actions are looking right now at second base. He looks really comfortable around the position. He's still learning it, but it, it, I think it will be a lot shorter process than what people may think. No matter which position on the diamond they play, the tandem of Alcantara and Baez are closing in on Chicago. Here's the pitch. Baez swings and cracks one to deep center. Back goes El Monte. He looks up. Straight away center field. So long. I will really be amazed if they're not big league all-star. There is no doubt that the Cubs are loaded with middle infield depth at double A. For the leadoff man, I'm Mick Gillespie.